soil, soil. Today we're going to make a filter. And if you want to learn about why filters are important, we're going to make a web, a link, if you want to learn about it, why filters are important. The one thing about filters, filters are important because they clean out water. Every living thing needs water, needs it. If you drink dirty water, you can actually get sick. So that's why filters are important. One thing, that's one thing about it. So what you need is soil, pebbles, medium gravel, small gravel, sand, charcoal, cotton balls, and grass and leaves and scissors, a spoon. And you can do that if you want to test it out two empty bottles. So we need a pitcher and a two liter bottle. So step one. Yeah, you need a pair. Because it can, you can cut yourself. All right, so we're cutting just a little bit above halfway up on the two liter bottle. Uh-huh. My dad is my assistant. So after we're done with the cut, we should be able to put it in just like that. Oh, why, okay. do, we, why do we need it like that? Because our, our soil and stuff is going to be up here, and the water that we filter out, all the clean water is going to be down here. And then we can take that out and then drink. Yep. That was the first step, cutting. So now you need to stuff a cotton ball in. Like that. Like that. That's perfect. Yep, the charcoal. Hold it. Okay, all the charcoal. Layer. That's one layer. Okay. Next is sand. It's okay if it's wet sand. Then we're gonna do small gravel. And then it's medium gravel. Can you yeah. see? Go ahead, you shake it. Pebbles. Mm -hmm. Look at our clean water. 
Okay, let's pour it in now. So we're going to pour this into our clean water. Yep. Container. And then we'll compare, okay? Here it is. So let's show the differences. See how this one is looks browner and polluted? This one looks polluted, but this one looks a little bit lighter, like regular water. It looks a little bit lighter. So thanks for watching, guys. You, I think you should do the experiment. 